My name is Vincent Bilo of Bilo Farms. I'm one of the owners here along with my wife, Trudy, my son, Andrew, and my daughter, Jessica. We decided we wanted to grow our farm for the future, lower our carbon footprint, and make it more efficient and labor friendly and cow friendly and employee friendly. Vincent Bilo and I met in 2015 to start planning for this new project. And one of the things he had asked me for is he wanted a picture of a rotary parlor that he could put on his office wall as a vision for all the employees to be able to see so they could see the future of what Bilo Farms wanted to become. Flash forward to 2021, talking through the numbers and what the vision of the farm was, the decision was made to build a Greenfield 4,500 cow site. And so construction started in April of 2022 on this new milking center along with two 2,000 cow freestyle barns. One of the bigger challenges is labor. Our parlor was very labor inefficient. Our new parlor, our goal is to have three people in it. Our goal is four and a half seconds per cow unit attached, 750 cows per hour, 25 to 28,000 pounds milk per hour through the system. It's a T8900, 100 stall, rotary parlor. On the platform, we have the Demetron 60 detachers along with PPID ID system, and also the platform features rubber decking. We also use the Future Cow Prep Brush system along with the Uttermister 2.0 post-dip spraying system. We also feature the ProMotion hydraulic crowd gate along with dual Auto Select 5000 sort feet. What we like to talk about with the T8900 system, we use a proven nylon roller system. The deck itself is concrete, so it's a little heavier, a uh, little bit more robust for many more years of service. The top side is stainless steel, which will last a long time, and the features are very simple. We have one cylinder that operates the detachers. The drop down is unique to Gia to be able to have the arm drop down below the deck, but it also presents the operator with an opportunity to attach the unit without ever performing any additional movements. So the reason that we went with Gia was one reason was the dealership. We have a strong dealer in the area. The other reason is I kind of stick to family history. When we built the parlor in 1999, we used a Gia dealer and I just wanted to stick with the brand. Talking with other farms, the ease of the Gia, the efficiency of the Gia, and the cows just seem to be more comfortable on a Gia platform than other platforms that we looked at. If I could describe the Gia T8900 in one word, I would say evolution. Because this platform actually started in the 80s as the auto rotor. And since the 80s, we've continued to develop and continue to re-engineer, continue to add benefits, longevity, unique features to the old auto rotor platform. What excites me most is that we'll finally be able to milk our cows three times a day and we'll be set up on a modern parlor. By doing what we have done, this farm should be efficient for the next 20 years plus. It will allow our employees to work less, and one of our goals is to have our employees have more time to their families too. It's very important to us to take care of our employees.